Hi boys and girls, I'm back. I just uploaded the Easter egg math game and now I'm gonna show you how to do the Easter egg alphabet letter game. So now you're gonna take your extra Easter eggs at home or old ones that you were thinking of throwing out and you can use them for this activity. So you're gonna do all different colors. You're gonna write the uppercase letter at the top and lowercase at the bottom. So what letter is this? A, that's right. And what letter is this? B, that's right. And this one? C, good. How about this one? D, good. What comes after D? E, after E? F, that's right. After F? G, what's after G? H and then I J K L good. M N O W X Y and last letter Z that's right so write your uppercase on top lowercase on bottom after you're done writing all of them you can mix them up so take them apart so it's just like matching how we did with the numbers. We're gonna match the lowercase to the uppercase. Now it's probably easiest if we put maybe the uppercase on one side and we will put the lowercase on this side. Kind of sorting them so we don't get the tops confused. After we're done matching our upper and lowercase letters, we're going to stack them just like how we stacked our numbers. Now, do you think our letter tower will be taller than our letter tower? I mean, do you think our number tower will be taller or shorter than our letter tower that we're gonna make now. You think the letter tower will be taller than the number tower? Maybe. All right, I'm almost done. Now it's definitely a good idea when doing the Easter egg game to have an extra tray to keep the eggs in so they don't roll around. All right, so we'll go in order. First up, A. So now I'm looking for lowercase a. Is this it? No. Is this it? No. How about this? Yes, so that's our match. All right, and after A, we said was B. So we're looking for lowercase b. Is this it? No, Oop, that should be on the side. How about this? Is this lowercase b? No. How about this? Yes. So, Here's our match, uppercase and lowercase b. What's after b? C, 
see, that's right. Let me find C over here. Okay, here's uppercase C. Now we're looking for lowercase C. Is this it? No, how about this? Nope. This one? No. Oh, I think I know. Is that lowercase C? Yes. Lowercase C looks just like uppercase C, except lowercase C is smaller. That's all. This one's a little bit tricky to close. There we go. So they look the same except lower C is, lowercase C is smaller. All right, after C is D. Where is my D? Good, that's D. But where is lowercase D? Is that it? No. Hmm. Is this it? No. Oh, let's see. Oh, how about this? No? Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. I don't know. Let's see. Where is lowercase d? How about this one? That's right. So uppercase and lowercase d. It's another match. After d is e. Oh, my kitty cat is saying hi. Oh, and he's making a video appearance. This is Dusty. Dusty, you say hi to all the boys and girls. He's very interested in all of these Easter eggs. He's been getting into them. Okay, so we're up to we're up to E, that's right. So we're looking for lowercase E. Is this it? No. How about this one? Whoops. No, nope, not that one. Ooh, let's see. Where is lowercase E? Oh, here it is. E. Okay, after E, F, that's right. So here's F. We're looking for lowercase F on the bottom. Is this it? No. How about this one? Yes. There's our match. That's F. After F, G. Good. That's our uppercase G. Now we need to find lowercase G. Hmm. Is this it? No. How about this one? Nope. How about this one? Yes. That's our match. What's after G? H. Good. Here's our H. I think I see it. Is this it? I got it right on the first try. Letter H. And after H, I, that's right. So lowercase I is a line down with a dot on the top. Hmm. Does this look like lowercase I? Nope, it doesn't have the dot on top. How about this one? Yep, this is lowercase i. What's after i? J. Hmm, where is lowercase j? Lowercase j also has a little dot at the top. Let's see. There it is. So we're matching all of our letters. J and then k. K for Katie. Let's see, where is lowercase k? Is this it? No. How about this? Yes. Our upper and lowercase k. After k, L. L, little, lowercase l is just one big line down. Just like that. Super easy to write. After l is mm, m. Where is my m? Is 
There it is. Okay, and let's find lowercase m. Hmm. Is this it? Let's see. Is this it? Nope. How about this one? Yes. M and then N. Good. Let's see. Does that look like lowercase n? Nope. How about this one? Yes. N and then Lowercase o looks just like uppercase o, except it's smaller. Does this look like o? Yeah. So they look the same, except uppercase is bigger and lowercase is smaller. What's after o? P, that's right. P. Hmm. Is this lowercase p? No. How about this one? No. This one? Yes. After P? Q, that's right. There's Q. Lowercase Q. Where is it? Hmm. There it is. So we're making our match. What's after Q? R, that's right. R. Hmm. Is this lowercase r? No. How about this one? Yes. R. And then s. S, that's right. Now here's lowercase s. It looks the same, except it's just smaller. What's after S? T, T, T. Good. T. Where is lowercase T? It's a big line down and a little line across the middle. Hmm. Where is T? There it is. That's our T. What's after T? U. That's right. U. There's lowercase u. Hmm. This one's a little tricky too. There we go. U. And then V. That's right. Where is lowercase v? It does look the same, except it's a little bit smaller. There it is. V. And then, who can tell me? W, that's right. Is this lowercase w? No. How about this one? Nope. How about this one? Yes. So that is w. And it does look the same, except it's smaller. That's right, good observation. What's after W? X, good. And X looks the same, lowercase x, except it's smaller. There's X. All right, what's after X? Y, that's right. So we have two left. Which one do you think is lowercase y? Good, if you said the blue one, you're correct. There's Y. And then the last letter, Z. And that also looks the same. Lowercase Z looks the same, but it's just smaller. Okay, so now that we have all of our upper and lowercase eggs matched, we're gonna pull them apart and we're going to stack them. So we're stacking the tops, the uppercase letters. And I wonder how big this tower will get. If it will be taller or shorter than our number tower that we just did. Okay. And I 
wonder if it will fall over or if it will stay up. So what are your guesses? Who can tell me? What do you think will happen? Some friends are saying it might fall over. Some friends are saying it might stay up. Let's see. Remember, we're, we're going to use just the tops to build the tower. And we're going to do it in order of how the alphabet goes. I'm almost done. A few more. Okay, boys and girls. So I have all my tops. So now the first letter in the alphabet is A. That's right. So we're going to put A here. What's after A? B. There's my B. After B? Good. C. After C, excellent, D, and then E, you're right, and then F, good, where is F, there it is, what's after F, G, great job, and after G, H, and then I, that's right, where is my I? There it is. What's after I? J. And then K. It's already getting taller than the number tower. All right, after K, L. And then M. That's right. And then N, O, what goes next? P, good. Oh, look how tall it's getting. What's after P? Q. Good, R is next. Who can tell me what comes next? S, if you said S, you're right. And then T. U. I hope it doesn't tip over. What's after U? V. Great job. What's next? Who knows? W. Oh, oh no. Let's see if I can fix it and get it back. A, let's see. I. I need, oh no. All right, let's try to fix it. H I J K. All right, let's see. We need L. We're going to try it one more time. L M N O P. Where is Q, R, S, T, U? I'm going to go slower so I don't tip it over. V, W. Let's go really slow. X, oh no. What's after X? Y. I have one more. Do you think it will stay or tip? All right, let's see. Z. Wow, look how tall our letter tower is. All right, so if you have these eggs at home and you want to give this a try, go ahead. And again, just like the math activity, if you make a tower, Send in your pictures so we can see how tall yours is. Have a wonderful day, and I will see you boys and girls very soon. Oh, there they go. I hope you enjoyed this fun activity. Go outside and also enjoy some sunshine. All right, bye, boys and girls.